All right, welcome or welcome back, new viewers and game bears. Time for some more Tears of the Kingdom, and hey, off screen, I made it to the top of the mountain. And now we got ourselves a little cutscene. Let us see what happens. Look over there. It's a mountain. Riveting, dude. And he just starts. Ro okay, without warning, just goes, "Hey, Link, over there. Let's start rolling." Yeah, I did lose a little HP because I uh, broke Link's legs off screen. Anyways, what did you want to say, dude? And then that's when he smothers me and Link's dead. I think it was I, near oh, here. Worse. When I came up the mountain, I saw her. The princess was standing right here, Goro. And then she gave me this fancy mask to wear around. After that, um... Oh, jeez. It's no use. I can't remember anything that happened after that. Suddenly, Silver the Hedgehog. <laughs> oh my god, there she goes being she flaky is, again. Princess! Princess Zelda! We need to talk to Still you! really like that dress she's wearing. I'm, not, I'm never gonna stop saying that. Hello, Cloud. How you doing today? The volcano is erupting. There's something moving up there. More Agia. I gotta fight that thing? Mate, I was just doing some rock climbing. What, I can't enjoy my hobby? You know, Link's favorite hobby is rock climbing, right? At least in this game. Well, that... That thing broke out of the crater and it was like nothing. Is that marbled rock, is it alive? And there's three of those things. Hang on, no. Those are hands? It's so big. <laughs> uh, how could something that large appear out of nowhere like that? I've never seen anything like this on Death Mountain, Goro. If we don't take that out, who knows what will happen to Zelda. That's probably just natural projection. Uh, but I can't charge at it from down here. Any ideas? Like, yeah, we run. Now, running's for sissies, we're gonna get up there, but first, because I'm a little weakened myself, I gotta eat. I got to eat, okay. Well, this is real big. Now, nah, Link's dealt with bigger and worse. Unbearable, wait, it's because I'm stepping on the frickin' rocks, no wonder. All right, good to know, we gotta avoid those. All right, climbing the rocks. How on earth could I possibly get up here? I want to say try to fire some arrows at him, perhaps. Oh, he's staring dead at me. Yeah, I can't stand on those lava rocks or else I'm going to take damage. All right, change of plans. I'm gonna go on the other side. Perhaps it's a little easier if we go through here. Getting some, oh my geez, I almost got hit. All right, let me gain some of my HP. Every day I'm just surviving, creep climbing the mountain. Even when I feel like dying. Okay. Hey, there's something up here. All right, it's a sign. All right, 100 famous mountains of Hyrule. Number one, Death Mountain Summit. Real helpful, dude. Okay. Oh, well, that, that didn't work. It's gotta be an easier way to fight this man, but I don't know what to do. Unless I can... No, Ultra Hand ain't, ain't helping here. Right, perhaps I could shoot it from here. Uh, 
I don't know what to do. I've come here, but I don't know what to do. Oh, perfect. We can use these. That's a Deus Ex Machina if I've ever seen one. Let's get down. All right, Link, get up here. Control them. Ow. Wait, I'm going down. No, I don't want to go down. Go up. God damn it, Link. Where'd you get your freaking your flight license? I may or may not be jabbing my own controls right now. All right, there we go. I think. Nope, nope. Still have, still don't, still don't have a hand on him. Come on, Link. Get up. All right. All right, here we go. Now we can do something. As soon as uh, this rises, this could take a while. If we can't hit it higher, we're gonna be in trouble. Yeah, uh, I'm just getting used to the controls, man. Give me some time. Oh my god, I'm going in the absolute wrong direction. Are these inverted controls by any chance? I'm trying to go upward so I can hit the guy. This where it feels like it's going in 20 different directions. All right. Ow. Yeah. That's one guy out of the way. Incoming is right. We're charging in here. We take names even in your own home. It's the time to be careful. Yeah, careful is probably the last thing I'm worried about. Especially while flying this thing. All right. At least the camera ain't inverted. That suck ass. All right, where's the other guy? You know, Link, uh, turning around would be absolutely awesome right now. Why is this taking so long? Oh my jeez. You can always say that the controls just take a bit of getting used to. But, and now I got a second. I missed somehow. I somehow missed. Where'd he go? Ow, oh, oh, there he is. I thought I just got hit a second there. Ah! No, I'm fine. I somehow didn't take damage despite that being a clear hit. Come on, you fool. Go down. Oh, this is the worst control. Right, can I hit him? Yes, I did. Ah, shit. All right. The ship got destroyed, man. I better hurry up and find a landing soon. I'm not gonna lie, as hard as this is to control, I'm kinda liking this. Alright, we still got a bit of gliding time. It's okay, it's okay. Ah, what is this? Like, we can't afford to let that monster run right. If we were too far away to hit it, it over. Wait, what? Oh, excuse me, dude, respond me where those ships are. All right, anyways, oh, it's a good thing it did spawn me there, nice. Anyways. You know what, ah, frick, let's use the Ultra Hand. Because this is totally the time to be customizing ships right now. We only need one, we only need to hit him one more time anyways. Come on now, let's go. Come on, come on, let's go, go, go. Onward to take down Moragian or Moragia. Not really a recurring Zelda villain, is it? At least that I can. Right, where's the last hit? There he is. There's the snake head I'm looking for. Don't take that out of context. You miss. <laughs> and I crash into a wall. I, oh, you can't be serious. That. Uh, Jump, dude. Right, I guess I'm gonna have to take a little bit of damage. All right, come on, let it go. Ow, I'm taking damage. This is so annoying to control. Why, what, why am I not rising? Why am I not moving? Okay, really, Ugh, these controls. Right, let's eat a few of these before I get back on the... That's not what I wanted. 
Come on, why am I not moving? Really? It's not letting me move. Is it really that stuck? Alright, screw you then. I'm gonna have to lay this flat then. Cancel there. I'm taking damage again. Alright, now can I move? I still can't. What the frick, man? It's literally not letting me move. Why? Ugh, this is stupid. You know what? I'm gonna try to reset this. Because that just makes no sense. That's not letting me move. Oh, perfect. I could just go down here. And, oh no, fall damage. Nice. Somehow, I didn't take fall damage. Ow, frick. Fuck you, man. I'm too busy trying to figure this out. All right. Cold resistance that I totally need right now. And, uh, I'm gonna try this one. Then. I think it just needs to be at a certain angle for it to start up. I guess when it's on a rocky surface, I won't do it. Just, these, these controls suck, man. As, as nice as this looks, and as fun as this boss fight is, these controls suck. I'm trying to turn it up, and it's taking too long to rise. We're coming for you. Okay, so the slightest turn and you just lose all momentum. Frack! Screw you, dude. Don't make fun of me. I hate how long this takes to turn. This is so annoying. <laughs> Alright, there we go. I guess if I just have it in a certain direction, it'll automatically rise. And I'm not the biggest fan of that. Turn around. If you'd please, that'd be absolutely awesome. Alright, can we hit you? No, no, don't do this to me. Alright, screw it, he's dead. He's gone, goodbye. I didn't get hit once. I totally didn't fall off a few times there. You, didn't, you can't prove it either. We, we did it. We did it. Was that, what was that thing anyway? Didn't you read the name? It's Moragia. I thought Princess Zelda walked off somewhere around here. Huh? Whoa. You didn't suppose she fell into that hole, did you? That would be awful. Come on, Link. Let's go hurry down there. You can. I still have to tread carefully, dude. Princess Zelda, don't you worry, we're coming. And he's gone. All right, suppose I gotta go after him. Gliding down. Yeah, we skydiving down here. Discovery Death Mountain Chasm. And I am on fucking fire right now. Ooh, this looks stunning. Oh, God. All right, go this way. Did he stop over there by any chance? Wait, that is land, right? Now let's go over here. Alright, and I literally can't go anywhere without getting frickin' fried, so... Let's see what this wisp thing does. A poey. A glowing spirit orb found all over the depths. Offer those to a bargainer statue for a variety of rewards. Can one of those rewards be a damn metal boat to get across this? 
I'd like that a lot. Okay, what the hell is that thing over there? And how the frick am I gonna get off of this? Oh boy, looks like I'm in a bit of a... Unless the alternator can do something. It illuminates the ground at the very least. I also want to try to glide over there and see what I can find. Yeah, I guess I got no other choice but to do that. Alright. This was a bad, a terrible idea. Oh no, 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 uh, uh, shit, I'm dead. Okay. I don't know how I'm gonna get over there now. Maybe I could try going over there. And I can't make this either. Okay, maybe I landed in a bad spot. Oh, that sucks a lot of ass. And that's where I'm supposed to go. Gee, lucky for me, I can totally get over there. See what the map's looking like. Alright, so he landed up there, apparently. But how am I gonna get across? I'm just, I'm surrounded by a bunch of lava. How are the saves looking like? I don't want to redo that boss fight, so we're not going to do that. I don't know where to go. I can't go anywhere. All right, let's load this back and let's see if that makes any differences. I'm just trapped. I can't go anywhere. Are you serious? I'm essentially softlocked. I literally can't go anywhere. Who thought this was a good design decision? Alright, because when I'm just falling down, I totally can see where the hell I'm supposed to go on the map.
Dude, I'm literally stuck here. Oh, you can I, I think I have to redo the boss fight. I, I can't get off this island. Great design decision, dude. Okay, first of all, I got a big old criticism. How the fuck was I supposed to know if I fell on any of these, I wouldn't be able to go back? Or at least get on one of the other islands, like that one over there. I was supposed to fall right there, but that wasn't shown on the map. At least before I hit the ground. So how the frick was I supposed to know that that was there? Secondly, if you're going to have all of these islands around, have a method to, for the player to get to the other islands. There, there's literally no way for me to get over there. At least no conceivable way that I can see. Alright. I said this in some previous episodes, but it's becoming more and more evident the more I play this. There are some glaring design decisions in some of these levels. Like this. What is this? How am I supposed to get over there? I try Gliding's the only way I could probably try. But guess what happens? End up hitting the frickin' lava. Unless there's a way to pump up the air or something I don't know about. Good game design, people. Good game design. Alright, one last try, and then I'm gonna have to reset the game. Because this, th great, just soft lock the fucking player as punishment. Nice, that's a real good fucking design decision there. I don't want to keep bragging the game on this, but just these design decisions are honestly pissing me off. Really? Alright, well, time to redo the fucking boss fight. Hope y'all like the first time, because you're about to see it again. Alright, note to here. self, I think I should save any time cutscenes like that happen. I and the I can't skip this. Right here, Goro. Another good design decision. Don't let the player skip the... the oh, never mind. Mask. You're just supposed to press certain buttons. Oh. Hmm. Boy, it's real big. Here I go. Freaking deal with these awful controls again. Dude, why is this so easy to freaking get trapped? What the hell, man? This is Ugh. No, don't throw it. I'm really not liking some of the design decisions in this game. My god. Just ends up being more infuriating, if anything. Dude, look how easy this is. Why am I getting trapped so fucking easily? Fucking move, dude. Easily becoming more infuriating than fun. Should not be that easy to get that trapped. So off target, but who cares? Incoming! 
I swear, the second you move in one direction, the entire ship just goes in a completely different way. It's kind of annoying. No, no, no. The fuck, why is it so easy to track this thing? I li I'm literally stuck, again. not okay and you know it'd be really cool if I can get up from here can you jump on the ship link fucking hell man no fucking choice but to get off of here now not gonna lie, this, this is infuriating. It's just. Eh. Yeah, cool. Take some fucking fall damage, asshole. I'm not liking these design choices. My god. It's like those are one fucking direction. You can't just turn those around all the time. I'd say maybe the angling might have something to do with this, but this is needlessly annoying. And the controls could have been a lot more simple. Also, why do I have to press down to go up? It's so stupid. For those of you out there developing a game like with controls like this, never make it inverse controls. Or at least don't make it inverse controls without giving the player the ability to change those controls. It just ends up being way more annoying than it is. Great, and I finally actually got hit by a damn meteor. And that should do it. I can actually hit one of these assholes without getting stuck or, you know, being an asshole. Can you move? Turn that way, thank you. It's kind of annoying when it doesn't do that. Alright, and let me learn from my mistakes and actually save this time in case I land on the wrong island. Because I was supposed to know that first time around. Alright. Let us go for the second time. Oh wait, I can see it on the map. Excuse me, I was too busy frickin' marveling at the sight of this game to fucking pay attention to the map. Let's go near the frickin' start this time. Or where I'm supposed to go. And just not on the first island that I see. Alright, there we go. Now, before I continue, I'm gonna save again, just in case any more bullshit happens. Hmm? Who knew it would look like this inside Death Mountain? Now that I look closer, I see a whole lot of those red rocks. Huh? Why would Princess Zelda be down here with all those marbled rock rows? Come to me. Huh? 
I'm hearing things again. Yeah, you might want to get that checked out. <laughs> I mean... But, I, I mean... You heard that too, right, Link? Guess I, I definitely heard someone speaking just now. Let's see, I, I think... I think it was coming from that away. Maybe this has to do with Zelda. Yep. I've got a heap and pile of questions for her, so let's hurry to where Zelda is. Heaping pile of questions. Get it? Because he's a rock monster and rocks tend to come in heaping piles? Okay. Alright, it'd be nice if I could see half the shit that's in front of me. And thankfully, there's some bulb lights over there. What do we have here? We can let that go for now, though. Why don't we hit this? Alright, no, I can't hit it for some reason. Now, let's see how that's marked on the map. It's all the way over there. Ah, oh, grand. And that's not a full bridge. But there's a lot of these poes out here. Poes. I'm gonna call them poes. I know it's pronounced Poe, but I'm calling it Poe's. Just sounds cuter. Getting attacked by things. Somehow didn't hit him. Here I go. Charge. Now, you know what? I don't think I need to waste my time with this then. Though it is in the way, and I need to climb that, don't I? I don't want to get too close to you. Huh, there are things back here. Yeah, keep finding them off, man. I, I really appreciate it. Oh, I guess we could use that to traverse the lava. I'm gonna go to the top here first. Come near me. Thank you. I'll just stay back here. While I... It's going through it. Ah, there we go. Is this a wheel or a motor? It's a wheel. Looks like a fire hydrant. Oh, interesting. I'm gonna 
want it. I don't want it to attach to the wheels. Okay, good. Now let's put this on lava and give it a spin. A spin? Hey, get it? Okay. Is it? It's submerged through the frickin' light. You can't be serious. At least I can always drag the thing back up. Now maybe I'm supposed to have it on here. And this is gonna take a while. mind. Ah, for fuck! I didn't want to do that. Oh my god, I'm gonna hate this part of the game. I can't even see half the shit that I'm looking at either. What is it? What's the game trying to tell me that this can attach to? Oh great, dude. I'm serious to jump into two of this shit off screen. I am not liking this. Great, dude. Great. I don't even think I should go that way. Uh, and the game's kind of forcing me to, though. It's just hard to see, and there's no illumination either, despite us being in the fucking volcano. You'd think us being in a volcano, there'd be a lot more illumination. Honestly, I think I'm just gonna go around wherever the frick that was. I uh, just screw that. I can't. I can't fucking see deck either. It's just no. Too infuriating for my liking. I guess I wasn't supposed to go over there. Poeys, give me boy the poeys. The will of the wisps are already better than the ones in Legends Arceus. Uh oh. Hey, <laughs> you're on fire. Take that, toasty. Give me them rewards. <sighs> really wish this was better illuminated. I can't see shit and it's hurting my eyes. I don't even know where I'm going. Where am I climbing? I can just barely see the side of this mountain that I'm climbing up. Alright, well, let me just wait a second while I recover. How close are we to our destination? Not that close. There should be another wall over here, I think. I really can't tell, this is so hard to see. Ah, uh, there we go. Uh, there's some blue thing in the background there. I might have just gotten a bit distracted. Ah, maybe we're in a little city now. Well, we'll see for, uh, sooner or later. 
Traveler's sword, which is still rusted. A very common sword often kept by travelers to fend off small beasts. It's fairly durable, but a bit unreliable against monsters. Eesh. Oh no, what is that? Just for a safe fall. And I can maneuver around him. I don't think I'm supposed to fight those things. Oh my god, it's a whole freaking uh, colony of them. Oh no, of course you're going where the poeys are. And right, we can always wait here for a bit. I feel like I'm playing a stealth game right now. Stay over there, please. Allow me to grab the tasties. Oh, for frick. Kill him. Kill the bat. Thank you, Yonobo. Anyways, let's keep moving. Well, for something else finds us and I can't see it. Actually, I could have just used Yonobo to kill those guys. Why didn't I think of that? I really hope whatever awards we get from these bowies is going to be real good. Oh my god, that's a lot of them. What's that? Oh, hey, the one shot's them. Perfect. That makes this a little easier. I got two. Ha! He's dead. That's another. Okay, maybe not that soon. I mean, what is he holding? Look how long that is. Holy shit. Give me it. No, it burned. Wait, no, it's still good. What is this? Now I'm on fire. Of course I am. Rusted Halberd Spear. That sounds pretty cool. And horrible Horn. Alright, an elongated hammer-shaped horn with a flat... A hard flat front. Attached to a weapon to increase attack power or cook it with a critter to make an elixir. That sounds nice and tasty. Alright, best get rid of that man over there though. Man, I'm the archery king. Ah. Alright, why don't I equip my oh. I'll get rid of this one. We don't need that. Give me that rusted Albert. Let's see what the range is like on you. It's nice and long. Do not take that out of context either. Alright, so, I think I can use him to get rid of these. Alright, it makes our traversals a little easier. I don't know why I keep forgetting the fact that I can do that. Alright, there's a bit more illumination now. And I think we are where we're supposed to be. Fire Temple, Lost Gorondia Rediscovered, Rediscovered, nice. Alright, you know what to do, we're gonna break this here, uh oh. Huh. Is this where I heard the voice coming from? From all the way back there, bullshit. Alright, before I continue, just in case some weird shit happens, we're gonna save.
This is, is it's this way. All right, Fire Temple, Floor One, Elden Canyon Depths. Inside a volcano, probably one of the best um, temples I'm seeing now. I mean, I know there are some Zelda temples in previous games that are in lava-like areas, like in, in uh, Link Between Worlds, but other than that. What is, what is this place? And why is something like this inside Death Mountain, huh? She was not there a second ago. Fucking bullshit. Uh, it's Princess Zelda. Please wait, Goro. I, I gotta talk to you. Stop simping for her, man. There are other chicks out there. Plenty of fish in the sea. What the... Where'd she go? That isn't her, man. Just forget it. Get over here. Go. We're gonna break this wall. No wall stands in our way. There's something up ahead, Goro. This way. Hey, right, before I continue, let me eat something. Because we are snacking today. Now just one chicken we'll have to do. Oh. Link over there. Huh? It's Zelda Goro. No, not good, not good. Princess Zelda's stuck inside there. We gotta hurry and help her. But how do we get in there, Goro? How do we get in there, indeed? That is the puzzle we must solve here today. Alright, let's see what we can do. Did you see that? The gate, it moved a little just now, Goro. You hear that? There it is again. Young Little Rock. Young Little Rock. The gate you must pass, the gate you must pass through, through is firmly locked, locked with five padlocks. padlocks. You, have the power you have the power to unlock them all. Do so, Do then the gate should open. Then the gate should open. Heed Why are two of them essentially words. in the same spot? Heed my words. Huh? No, n no, de uh, no denying. I heard it loud and clear this time, but who could it be? And what did they mean by young little rock? They meant you, you doofus. They did tell us how to open the gate, so they can't be all bad, right? So all we gotta do is unlock the five locks, and then we can get in there. Get in there, man. Alright, which is the first one I should go after? I don't know, just pick one! Let's go over here. Alright, let me bring out one of my rock weapons. Real quick before it burns. Okay, never mind. That was a terrible idea. I can do it. That's also a terrible idea. Well, isn't that fun?
Can't even go that way, and that is so annoying. Oh, there's an enemy. Here I go. Godly can't jump for for his life in this game. Let's try that again. Jump. Oh my god. Trying so hard not to fall in there. One, two. Gee, look how easy that was, anyways. What do we have here? There's literally fire hydrants. Gonna be honest here, I'm not really sure how they're supposed to be used here. Alright, you know, I got an idea. Let's try this. Okay. Uh, I see now. Set that from farther, that should make another stone. Turn that off. Hey, I can even move the stones. Not bad. Not bad at all. Looks like we got ourselves some railroading to do as well. Good to know that that does that. Another one of these dudes. Alright, if you just open up, alright, do your fire attack. That's fine, you can't hit me past there. And I'm running out of arrows, and I don't like that. Oh no, not my friend.
Man, this man can take some hits. I keep hitting him. Oh my jeez. At least he can take those hits. And my spear's broken. It's down. Hey, look at that. A fire like stone. A stomach stone that persists even at high temperatures. It retains heat even outside the body of the creature that contained it, which makes it a useful elixir ingredient. Yep. There's a whole treasure. That thing was holding a treasure chest. Also, he just kicks it to open it. Xanite shield. A shield used by a Xanai and made of Xanite. It lowers the energy consumptions of an attached Zonai device. Nah, not bad. That sounds pretty cool. And hey, I get some fire fruit from it. One of my favorite items. Now, why don't I equip this new shield? Oh, it's already equipped it. Perfect. I can do it! All right, noticing that I can't just angle this. I got an idea. Let me go get one of those fire hydrants. One second, can I use this? Hold on, I got a crazy idea. I can't do it. Never mind. Alright, I want to get one of these fire hydrants over here. Preferably one of the ones that are standing up. Just, to, just to save myself some time from having to turn it. And why don't we make ourselves a platform? And it, okay, bad idea. Oh, and I can still fish it out of there. Or we can, actually this is a flat surface right over here. Let's do this. I mean, I'd like to know where the hell the water's coming from, but whatever. <laughs> okay. And now all I need is, of course, he's on the other side. And, okay, you just despawned. Or maybe we might need to bring one of these, perhaps? I'm gonna try using one of the cards. I might have just made this needlessly hard for myself. No, 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 no. Oh, you know what? What else I could do? Actually, I could make a bridge with this. Hold on. I can do 
There we go. Now, if only you... Yeah, we just climb up here. All right, perfect. Now we got that done. Now give me what I came here for. Well, Link, check that out. Oh. What is that thing? It looks like a gong. And I know just how we're gonna use it. That must be the first padlock, Link. That must be the first padlock, Link. Ah, uh, there are four more of us to find. Uh, that's a lot. Four more of us? What do you mean by us? Temple, Fire Temple Floor 2. I got an idea, actually. What if we did this? That didn't go too well. I think I had the right idea about something.
Oh no. <laughs> Hang in there, Goro. Well, it's about time I eat some of these steaks then. Uh, we could always make more. Take him out, man. Take him out. Shit, I made a mistake. Alright, thankfully that mistake's been rectified. Here I go! Goodbye to that enemy. He's gone. Alright, now let's get our prize, or at least one of our prizes. Three to go. Three to go. Let's hurry, Goro. Now notice I keep changing his voice. We got one that's down here. There's another right in the right below us, I'd say.
Alright, it's either below us or above us, but it's kind of hard to tell. Maybe it's above. How are we going to get up? I guess old-fashioned climbing. You know what they say. Every day I'm just surviving. Keep climbing the mountain. I right, just gotta regain some of my stamina. Oh no. Thank you. 
All right, fire tumble, fourth floor. All right, now I think we're a little bit closer to where the next one is. Gee, where were you when I was doing all that climbing? All right, let's not fall down there. Alright, that's where our next goal is. I can do it! Here I go! Alright, I got I a better idea it. thanks to the slope. You should just be able to hit up like that. Maybe we'll just use these to make a bunch of stacks. Alright, clearly this is not the intended way for me to be up here. I don't know what they expect- what do they expect me to do here, actually? I know what they want us to do. Alright, I got an idea. I know what we can do. I think we're supposed to stack these up a certain way. I just had the biggest aha uh -huh moment of my life.
Alright, clearly that needs to be a bit higher. There we go. There is our third one. Just two left, Link. Just two left, Link. Let's keep it up, Goro. Let's keep it up, Oh, he, ow, oh, okay. Oh, that, that's a bad, that's an untimely end. All right. Well, all right, we've been on here for a little bit now. So I'll try to figure out at least one of these other ones off screen then. That's uh, my idea. It looks like I'm going to need a slope for that guy over there as well, but uh, I'll figure this stuff off off screen. Anyways, if you all enjoyed this edition of Legend of Zelda 2 the Kingdom playthrough and you want to see more, please, and you enjoyed all my suffering and me resetting and all that stuff, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and follow. Hit one of the videos you see on screen right now if you're on YouTube and that bell button for more. I'd like to give a special thank you to Cloud for joining me once again. Anyways, in the next episode, we will finish the rest of the Fire Temple. Anyways, thank you everybody for watching, and see you next time. Have a nice rest of your day.